Good morning, everybody. It's Monday morning. Kind of a dreary, rainy day. We got one with a roof on it, at least. We got pumping this thing into the bulkhead out back. So we needed to reach it with a pump. Concrete's here. Just about mixed up. Pump's getting primed out. We'll go down and check it out by the, by the bulkhead. So we'll prime the line out right there. Get that get that greased up so it don't clog up and then we'll put a little bit of Portland cement through the line that's in the house in the basement and then everything hook everything together and then we should be good Tell us you need good? No, that's it. I'm down prime out. Put me away till he primes out. Yeah. Yeah, you said put your thumb up on that little ledge piece that's kind of back there. Yeah. Jeez. The bottom of that one. Yep. Get that. Oh, good. Good. Thank you. There we go. All right. Hey, somebody let me know when we get concrete, not just the slurry. Just, I'm gonna go slow until we get please concrete. We'll turn it up a little bit. All right. Thank you. Thank you. You ready? Yeah. Hold on. Oh, Get that in. Will that reach over here? Just get a little bit of that slurry there. Okay, Gene. Are you managing anything for the ledge? Yeah, he wanted to just kind of budget it a little bit if we could. Why there's no poly down here, huh? Okay! You can't have right off the bat. What? In the bug. That was done on that. Go a little bit faster. That's okay. You put both bags in? Yes. You want to go up one more slump in? Or yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah, please. Okay. Now we should have at least a yard and a half extra to play with, plus whatever ends up in the hopper. <clears throat> Here we go. Yeah. Uh, all we've heard is McGee. McGee. Yeah, but we're not positive yet. No. They, they took all the trucks out of there. Yeah, they had a bunch of the trucks up there. They, they had some mixture. So I had six trucks one day, and they were all like half of the front, half of the Yeah. They it's they a little bit really right Really? Oh, yeah, yeah. That's 
Back a little A little more where his feet are, yeah. Now we'll go right, we'll try to keep it right straight across if we can, okay? Go back to your right a little bit. I'm gonna go back, Harvey, okay? Back to your left. Ah, she's all ready. That's it, first drop. I don't know. We'll make it work somehow. Close. <laughs> May have to drop that down a little bit, Luke. So, well, he's got a yard. seven yards. Seven yards will do 560 square so, feet. Actually, that's at, probably six. Yeah, I know. I'm, the second truck's got seven. Yeah. 560 square feet at four inches. So, 560 square feet gets us right to about right to about here is what I measured. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. So fifteen times fifteen times thirty-two is five hundred. So five five sixty gets us to about here at four inches, and there's only like two to two and a half up there. So I, I think we're going to be okay. Worst comes worst, we may have to bucket a little bit out of the hopper. Yeah. Do the bulkhead. Yeah, yeah we, we I think we can take one off, yeah. We're gonna take one off, Gene. Gonna take one off? Yeah. I'm gonna set my remote right there. I'm gonna take that off and get the other one back in. Thank you. So like the right old man. It's a good thing the Bruins pulled it out the other night and over down. Yeah. Thank 
Hold him up. Hold up! I'm gonna take one off! Okay. We'll go a little bit more before you. Yeah. I wanna make sure we got enough. Yeah, I wanna make sure we got enough. You guys ready? Hold on, I'm gonna go in a little bit. Yeah, you should pick up both by the way. Okay, ready. Watch it there. Like that. Good shape. Alright, just have him pull it back when you're ready. Yep, yep. Pull it back. You go up. Good. We're almost to where the hopper can do it. Yeah. Is it okay, Luke? Yep. A little more here, yep. Need a little more there, there you go. A nope. little more, Gene. Not more. Back, yeah. Good. Hold up a minute. Think we're gonna do it. We'll make it. We're gonna speed up. What? Yeah, we'll we'll be a couple minutes. Yeah. yeah. You guys good for a minute? Yeah. Actually, we we'll strike that. Darren, can you just fudge that a little bit? Yeah. Or loop one or the other. We take a little bit. Straight in there, Luke. A little bit. Yeah, a little more. Good.
You want to strike it? Yeah. There it did, yeah. I'm mad at that. Come my hamstrings are screaming. Why? I think we can sweep, yeah, sweep that in, sweep that in, come right down. All right, Gene. Ready? Yeah. Back a little bit. Do you even have a mark in here? Okay, good. Hold on. Okay, hold that. Yeah. Got nothing in there. Oh. No. Hey, you're the scientist, man. <laughs> Do a little bit low. Yeah. <laughs> you right on there, Darren? Yeah. Good day. Uh... Hold on just a minute, Gene. You got it, buddy. This is good here. A little screed right there, Javi. Uh, six, okay. Six footer, please. Couple, couple pumps, I think. Yeah. Yeah.
Ja. Let it dribble. Let it dribble and we'll pull it right out. Done dribbling? Yeah. Alright, yeah, I gotta... Yeah, we'll have to... Yeah, you just swing it. Now watch your head, David. Um, Alright. I'll jump just out. Watch your head, guys. There is a limb right on my boom. Watch your head. You need anything there? Pull float. I'm picking up a little bit so we get out of it. All right, so the guy we're working for today does the foundations here. And, you know, we get paid in advance. We had a little trouble with him a long, long time ago, like 12, 15 years ago, we stopped working. Now, he's asking us to do his floors, so he's paying us in advance of us getting here. He's supposed to come get them all ready, shoot the grades, tell us the yardage and everything, and we're struggling with that a little bit. So we, we're gonna have plenty today, but like the concrete truck is out and we're down to what's left in the hopper so we're gonna make it but that's just a little too close figuring for me especially when we're this far away from the concrete plant you know we don't want to be running out of concrete and then having to try to figure out what we're gonna do to either drop the grade of the floor down or call the concrete company have them send a balance so we got to get a little better at him at him uh, shooting the grades, figuring the concrete. That that sub base in there wasn't anywhere near level. That wasn't graded very good at all. There's really there's really no reason not to be able to grade that good, at least flat. Even if there is a little bit of ledge in the basement, you still should be able to grade it flat. Oh, I got a rock in my boot. Got to get that out. Well, anyway. Good, good little pour for a day like today, and it's not great weather to be pouring outside. Still a little bit of a risk of a shower. So at least we don't have to stress about getting rained on. Just a little dark down there, a little chilly. We put quite a bit of accelerator in the concrete, though, so it should, it should cure up plenty good enough. Well, that's going to do it for this pour. So we'll get all cleaned up. Pump guy's got to clean everything up, clean out his hopper. Concrete guy, concrete truck driver's all cleaned up. He's just hanging out so he could use his water. Darren's probably finishing up in the bulkhead. We'll go check on him one more time real quick. Usually that takes the longest getting out of that bulkhead than doing the rest of the floor. All in all, though, went pretty good. We was a little worried about not having enough concrete after the first truck. But where we started up here, the floor was five and a half, six inches thick up this end. So the first seven yards didn't even look like it went a third of the way. Finish it. You want another scoop? I think we're going to need one. What do you need? A shovel full? Right there, yeah. Oh, right, right there. And yeah, got lucky on that one. Probably had what, a quarter of a yard or maybe a little less. That bulkhead was thicker than I thought. Perfect. Also another rainy morning, right? I bet the aggregate was soaked down. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. All right, that's going to do it for the pour. So we'll leave Luke here to finish Hill Power Trial. Darren and I are going to go work on setting up some other jobs for the rest of the week. That's going to do it. Nice and dark down there. Typical finishers residential floor. Thanks for watching guys.